If you like this video, please subscribe to my channel. Also, don't forget to click the bell icon. That way you'll be notified of any videos that I upload. Thank you and enjoy your day, evening, or wherever you are. I'm sure that everybody once again saw the train, but I'm going to get more footage of it in the future. I'm over at the Union Station Farmer's Market by the train station, and I do have my morning coffee, even though there's a little bit left. But like I said, I'll do a walk around of it. People are there and I don't want to film if there's anybody there. So I'm going to try and get some footage of the farmer's market, the vendors, and see what they got. They have it every year, every summer. So if you get a chance... Stop on down on Saturday and uh, enjoy the food. And they usually provide entertainment, but there's there's no band playing at this time. So, all right, enough of the chit chat. I'll do some footage of the vendors. All right, so I'm just walking around checking out some stuff. And then there are other vendors from inside the building, so I'm going to get footage of that in a minute. But they got some good stuff over there, and they bring their dogs too, which is nice. Oh, there's a train over there, Silver Spring. I'll also get some footage of that too. And you can see where I walked. And then there's the inside of the building where there are more vendors here. You know, now that I think about it, you can actually see how evolved Union Station is over the last few decades, starting from the train pickup and drop off to the farmer's market every Saturday. And then there are benches over there. And there's also a bike parking spot right there. I didn't bother to park the bike there because there's one over there at the very end. But anyways, there's the bike parking. So you can check out all the action. I actually sat at one of those tables earlier and, just, and probably in just a few minutes ago out on the benches. So definitely a, a good day to enjoy the farmer's market here at the train station.
And now this is the entrance into the Union Station where you have the farmer's market. I'm over on the side of the building here. And then there's another bike parking. I just parked the bike there. So, and they also do curbside pickup. And there's Bag Screw, the Bag Square Brewing Company. And look at this vintage train, number 6721, New York Central. Oh, that's sick, man. I don't know if you could read it too closely. I'll try to zoom in. But it says American Locomotive Company 54075 Schenectady Works. December 1913. Well, wow, that's a cool old locomotive to be on display. And then there's an old train over there. Wow. Adirondack Scenic Railroad. Memories of when I used to go on the train when I was a kid. New York Central 6721-060 Class B-11K, built 1913 by American Locomotive Company, Schenectady, New York. Utica and Mohawk Valley Chapter National Railway Historical Society owner. That goes to show you how much history... Utica, New York has, but also the history of many cities in New York State. And then there's a restaurant over here with the uh, chairs and the umbrellas sticking out. More benches over here. And there's a bench, three benches where that guy's sitting, probably waiting for the train. And over there is the Children's Museum. I used to go there with my family when I was a kid, back in the early to mid 1990s. And then there's the DMV parking. There's also a DMV over here. But that's going to be real busy, the DMV. Well, it's been about probably a little over three hours since I started filming about the Union Station and the Farmer's Market. And I even got to do some train action. So, I'm back at... This bike trail there that leads from this is Leland Avenue if you see the bridge right there this is Leland Avenue and this bike trail goes from here to the Aquavino Harbor Park restaurant and right over here is Canal Park where it's a they have local radio stations in upstate New York, and as you know, every Tuesday evening, they host the Tuesday What the Truck event. So, 
every Tuesday is where they start the that event. I haven't gone to it in a while, so I heard it's a good event. But it's such a nice day over here. And it's starting to show a little overcast. I even felt a little sprinkle. But it's not supposed to rain all through this week. So. I thought I'd give everybody a little, a little sight, a little tour of Utica. I'm sure there might be more that I haven't gotten to yet but we'll see about it Woo wee that is quite a ride but it's not as bad of a ride as I thought so now if you see all this dirt and mud right here I forget what they're doing but each time I come out here it's like they're doing something on the on the water over here And then there's the dock right there. And if I ever, if I ever got up on top, going up the steps with it, I could just get inside and look at the view from down there. I don't know, but anyways, such a nice view. I don't know what they're doing over here. Judging from all this mud over there, they're probably building a foundation or something. I don't know. And yeah, we'll see. And if I ever make an update video of that, I'll let you guys know about it. Still a very peaceful place to go fishing. Early this morning when I came here, I saw a couple people, or maybe three or four people, fishing. And that was about it. And I've seen a few more people over there. But that was before this ever came here. But they had their boat right there, so... Up the steps we go. Such a beautiful place. And there's the bridge slash walkway. I'm gonna get that shot one more time. They still gotta they still gotta take care of the lawn over here. Because this section was done, and then somehow they forgot to finish that huge section. But other than that, it's such a peaceful place to be. Alright, so that just about wraps up the video. But don't worry because there will be more content to upload very soon. All I want is for everybody to be safe, enjoy yourselves. Go out on the bike trails, or if you're not going to go on the bike trails, then at least go biking. And maybe from time to time I will upload some train videos. Who knows? But, alright guys, this is Mike signing off.